Hello guys and welcome back from Fabrizio Romano on my YouTube channel guys as every single day trying to bring you behind the scenes of the transfer market of football talking about managers, transfers, contrast, new signings so guys subscribe here to my channel and be part of the family turn on your notification bell so I'm waiting as always for you and reading your comments and guys today we talk about Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, Manchester United manager because what they did on Saturday is something really important to clarify the situation of Solskjaer. So on Monday, uh, one uh, week ago, my United at the beginning of uh, the week, what they said uh, is that they wanted to think about the situation after the terrible game with Liverpool. So my United in their day board were thinking about the possibility of firing Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. It was a possibility, but it was not done because May United, the main part of the board, together with the opinion of Sir Alex Ferguson, that is not deciding anything into May United, this is important to clarify, but his opinion, and he's a legend of football, not just for May United, of course, for May United, he gave his opinion, and his opinion was to confirm Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, to give him some time, to show him some confidence again. This is what May United board decided to do, and now we had the game with Tottenham, where May United won 3 Zero was an important game from a United with a new system for Solskjaer, so he decided to play with new system. Why? With the back three defense with Cavani together with Ronaldo. Because he said that Cavani in the training sessions during the week was incredible, was really incredible. I am told that the player during the week, they were really together trying to help May United to also help Ole to show also their responsibilities because it's true that the manager maybe has been a problem for May United in the last weeks, but also the players have to be considered. May United have a fantastic team and they wanted to show their value. So from top players like Cristiano Ronaldo and Davidson Cavani to other players in the team and also Rafael Varane back. So May United had the approach of their best players and this is not not a detail, guys, because if a group of players want to create a problem to the manager and maybe make him suck it in 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 few days in few hours they can lose the game with Tottenham they can't show their best skills and then this is a situation but with May United they were so professional and so we have to say very good job by Ole he did a good job because this week was really complicated for him with a lot of pressure with a lot of names around with Antonio Conte prepared to accept May United job uh, with many managers in the list they appreciate Brendan Rodgers Eric Ten Hag and also Pochettino but they are not available so a lot of rumors a lot of ideas coming from May United but they decided to back Solskjaer again and this is what happened uh, they decided to go on with him and May United won so it was a really complicated week but Solskjaer together with very respectful and professional players did it what is happening after this game this game means for May United that Solskjaer will be the manager also for Champions League game with Atalanta and also for the following one is expecting to be there with Man City with the derby of Manchester so it will be a very interesting one for for May United but um, I think it's really important to win this game 3-0 for, for Solskjaer because he's showing that the team is with him and then he has still possibility to change the situation in his future also from now to the international break to show to Man United owners and to Man United board that he's still the man for this project. So at the moment Solskjaer is going to continue as Man United manager but let's see with Atlanta and Man City if he will be able again as he did with Tottenham to show his skills. Let me say quickly guys really poor by Tottenham really disappointing at the moment they are not working to replace Nuno but let's see what is going to happen in the coming weeks months because as of now it's a new project with a new director of football with a new manager but was not at Tottenham level what we saw with Man United so guys let me know your thoughts on social situation here in the comments subscribe I wait for you to give you updates soon here on the channel thank you from Fabrizio Romano